What is going on you guys? Hello. If you click on this video, you are either very new to For Honor or you just want to make sure that you know everything there is to know about the game. If you're already if you're already experienced in this match or in this game and you want to move on to one of my later guides, you guys can go ahead and click on to those. Uh, when those videos come out, I'll link them in this video or they'll be in my on my channel, of course. But this video is solely for the beginners and how the beginners should train. So if you're very new to this game and you just started playing and you're wondering, hmm, how do I get better? Because my friends have all played it and they're like, hey, do all this advanced stuff and just practice it until you get it. Now, that's not actually a good way for beginners to learn now, is it? Jumping into the advanced uh, practicing situations. So what we're going to do is in this video, we're going to show the beginners how to train and how to improve their skill and then move on from there so we're gonna have three videos this first video is going to be for the beginners next one should be for the intermediate so those people that are just okay and looking to improve to a higher level and then those who are already really really good at the game and just want a way or a new way to practice so to speak so we're gonna go ahead and get started first thing you guys want to do if you're a beginner complete the tutorial if you haven't completed the tutorial you need to go and do that as quick as possible there is a way to do the tutorial I believe it's training yes you click on training and there's these two trials the apprentice trials which will be the very beginning uh, thing for you to do and whenever you launch the game for the first time I'm gonna tell you to do these and then beat your commander to go online once you do that you want to not go online you want to go to warrior trials now what I would recommend is getting an A plus rating on every single one of these that you can. On all of them. On here I haven't done it yet. A few of them I've missed like these two. And external block I can't get. I don't know why. I don't get hit during the trial. That's actually kind of hard for me. So you want to make sure you've completed all of these at least once. And then we'll go back and try to get an A rating on as many as you can. And in doing so, you should get an ornament for it. So make sure you go ahead and jump in and finish those. And then once you're finished with these two trials, you want to jump into training arena. Now, when you jump into training arena, what you want to do here is select your opponent. Pick a random opponent. Since this is your first time playing the game, pick any opponent you want to play against. Me, since I'm a, I want to say I'm immediate, intermediate, almost going to be in advanced. I'm still practicing some advanced techniques. I would like to play against a fast light character, so I'm probably going to pick a player like Gladiator or Orochi or Shinobi or Musha. Pick any of these players to play against, but just for the sake of the game, I'm going to pick a Warden. So once you've picked your opponent, which if you're a beginner, I would say pick Warden. He's one of the basic characters, and then launch the game. When you launch this training, you want to pick a character that does not say assassin so you see how warden right here under his name it said vanguard easy vanguard easy does not say assassin but if you highlight over peacekeeper it says assassin medium what assassin means is she has a reflex guard now reflex guard disappears over about i think the timer is like three seconds so you don't want to pick her yet Later on down the line you will, but for beginners, you want to pick a character with an all guard, I like to call him, or just a guard that never goes away. So I'm going to pick Warden just for the sake of the video as well, and you're going to jump into the training match. Okay guys, so now that you're in the game, in here you're ready to play against this bot. It is a bot, of course, you don't have to worry, it's not going to hit you when you start the match. What you want to do is hold L1 and then press the buttons or LB, left bumper, whichever console you're on, until you select or see the exact same uh, settings that I have. So it would be player health off, stamina off, opponent health regenerate, opponent stamina off. You want to have it like that. I'll give you guys another look really quick. Pause the video if you want. Go ahead and set that up. But what you want to do now that you're in this se section, you want to press start. Go to custom move set now for the warden he has a bunch of moves but for beginners i want you guys to understand only how to block and counter guard break counter guard break is a skill you need to learn in for honor it's a really good skill to have i didn't know it because i played i played day one and i didn't know how to counter guard break but everybody else knew how to guard break so i didn't know how to stop that so i figured it out so what we're gonna do you want to throw one of his attacks that are light and heavy based so that means I would pick 
at least leave at least one spot. So I, he has a his R1 R1 R2 R1 R2 and a R2 R2. So I want to pick these three moves for the warden, and then I want to scroll all the way down until I see guard break. You want to pick guard break as well. Have guard break on, and then when you want to head over to opponent settings and turn, you want to leave. Actually, no, my bad. You want to leave move cooldown on. Leave it on for right now just to get a basic feel. Now all you want to do is guard against this guy. Okay. There's a light from that side. So, you see that little window that pops up on the guard break? And by the way, guys, if you're not too familiar with how to counter a guard break when you see them try to grab you, my bad, I, we'll get to that later. When you see them try to grab you, you press square or X, depending on which console you're on. So square will be the left button and the D-pad of buttons, and X will be the left button and the D-pad of buttons on Xbox. So whenever you see that little grab pop up right there, you see it, I press square within that window. Now when you see the guard break pop up, when you see the guard break pop up, me, I usually spam it a few times. I don't just press it once. I press it like once or twice just to make sure I get that guard break counter because you can press it as many times as you want. I pretty much spam it. So when it comes to blocking, of course you guys already know you want to use the right stick to control which direction he attacks and which direction you block from. So you want to just sit here and practice blocking everything he throws at you. Once you're pretty comfortable with blocking attacks um, and counter guard breaking, you get pretty comfortable with it with move cooldown off. You want to jump in here and turn it off. My bad. Once you get comfortable with it on, you want to jump in here and turn that off. What this does is it makes him spam the moves. Instead of just waiting those three seconds, there's no wait in between. He just goes. And it's good. It's a good practice to get into, man. Sit here and practice blocking. Just sitting here and practice blocking all the warden's moves. That's all you got to do. Now, I do want to let you guys know if you're playing a warden. And he throws that top unblockable. I want to warn you guys: the unblockable is an orange attack. When the orange, when the strike, like right there, when it blinks orange, when it blinks orange, you have to parry it. So we'll get into that in the intermediate video more in depth. But for right now, I want you guys to know: to parry, you have to throw a heavy in the same direction that the attack is thrown. So for warden, it'll always be from the top. The unblockable will always come from the top, right there. And you have to throw a heavy in the exact same direction that the heavy is thrown. Or the unblockable is thrown, excuse me. So you want to sit here until you feel really comfortable with blocking every single move. Uh, countering every single guard break. Just keep doing that. And if you can't parry the unblockable yet, no worries. Just let it hit you. It's not a big deal. You're in training. You're in training. Just keep practicing it until you get it. And eventually you will learn the timing for that unblockable at least. But just sit here and get to practice. And that's pretty much all you guys want to do. You beginners that are learning how to play the game. Just want to sit here. I want to say for about two hours. Total. You don't have to do it all in one sitting. But just do it for about two hours. Until you get really comfortable. Block around ten attacks at once. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. But... Not at once, but see if you can block 10 straight attacks, not counting the unblockable. And that is the beginner's guide to training, man. So if you just launch the game, like I said, and you're just learning to play, jumping straight online, if you do this little tip right here, I guarantee you, you will be light years better than anybody you play against. If you've just bought the game. I got guard broken right there. And now, as far as offense goes... I will have a video detailing what each character can do. Their own separate video. I'll have a I will have a guide explaining what each character can do and how to play each character in their most effective way. And also how to counter the exact same character in the exact same video. So I'll have a video first, of course, going for warden, telling you how to play warden and how to counter a warden. After I get the beginner, intermediate, and advanced videos out for you guys. I will show you guys how to do that. So yeah, you just want to sit here and do this. It's been your boy Potion. If you like this video, you want to see more content, 
hit that subscribe button hit that bell button as well let me know in the comment section what you want to see uh, I'm pretty sure this is gonna be like a whole playlist for my channel I'm just gonna have a whole for honor uh, guide for everything in the game that I know from up to date 57 reps what I know uh, what my friends know how to play the game in my opinion the best way to do it and how to play each character but it's been your boy if you haven't been drinking that water make sure you get to drinking and I will see you guys in the next video